Your Jimmy Pedroza takes the ball now, now in inning number Boston. nine, looking to close number the door. 96. Stepping in, Jordy Mercer. He Way was retired Four via the ground harder. ball last time up. Down by a bunch Jordy. here. And what makes it even more Mercer. difficult, they're facing the closer. Not going to be an easy test trying to tie this one or go ahead here at home. You do not want to walk the eight-hole hitter. It just opens up so many options. Do we bunt them over to second with the nine-hole hitter? Do we try and play for that big rally with the top of the order coming up? The 0-1 pitch. Now a fastball gets the upper part of the zone for strike two. That pitch is in triple digits. I think he had to take that one because I'm not even sure he saw it. And a half-hearted attempt that time, but they'll say he broke the plane, and that's out number two. There's not a whole lot more he can do to instill confidence that he's going to wrap this thing up without any problem. And he tries to hold back on the swing, but I think it would have been ruled a strike anyway. It's nothing in one. First two men in the inning have both gone down via the punch out, so we'll see if he can fare any better. And this is swung on and missed, so now they find themselves down to their final strike tonight. He's one pitch away from striking out the side, but even more than that, to throw a donut up. Swing and a miss, he struck him out, and that'll do it here as the ball game is over. Well, just another day at the office for these guys. That stretches their winning streak to five, and they're playing well in all three phases of the game. Pitching, fielding, and hitting. Who knows how long this will last?